Have you ever been thrown under the bus? By that I mean, has anyone ever compromised you or uh, used you as an scapegoat? But I do tell the exact truth, exactly how it happens, to kind of give people a better idea of what's going on. And on my platform, I want to give God the glory for my life. And I'm going to tell everybody whether they want to hear it or not, Jesus Christ is my Savior, my Lord and Savior. Kick me off of YouTube if you want to. Kick me off. I'm not going to shut up and I'm not going to be quiet about it. Well, well, look who it is. Hey, girlfriends. Asha, must we endure her? I am so over her. I want to know why I didn't get the greeting I so deserved. I don't care if I was three hours late getting to camp and you needed to run errands. You should have been there to welcome me with a red carpet. That's okay. I will make two videos of how horrible the greeting was and how you treated me, even though we had a good time the night before and many got it on video. My goal was to destroy your channel by telling lies. I am no different than Nomadic Fanatic. I know we said we would meet up and so you canceled your trip to Washington to dog sit and see your dad while your brother went on a cruise. Even though I was house sitting and close by, I did the unthinkable and left town without ever getting back to you on when to meet. Oh well, you missed out seeing your dad and helping out your brother. Yep. You're always right, Terry. Since I've been a good boy, can I have another snack? I'm King Shitstirrer, and demand absolute loyalty from everyone even if I am wrong about stuff. So bow down to King Kevin the Shitstirrer. So Carolyn, I know you volunteered to take care of the wolf pack while I was in the hospital and on my deathbed, but that still doesn't make us good friends. And Carolyn? You are still welcome to my property, as long as you don't badmouth me, but give me praise on a constant basis. Now get to bowing down and kiss my ring. So anyways, we were supposed to meet up with Caravan Carolyn, but um, I was telling her, we just, one, we haven't gone hardly anywhere, except to the store to get, you know, groceries and to the Goodwill. And then we both have had this kind of crap going on the last couple days actually it's been almost four days so you know no big deal I just uh, I didn't think she would want to meet up with us and you know. hey Carolyn I know I was only two miles from you camping in Apache Junction I just didn't feel the need to say hi or meet up even though you never done anything to me to warrant such lack of consideration. I'm just too busy to maintain the friendship. Could anyone set up a welcoming committee for me and get the red carpet ready? If not, I will ruin you. Now go make me another drink. People were saying nasty things. They kicked me off and this, that, and the other. Spreading lies. Making opinions their opinions, truth, selling it as truth, disgusting it's who you are, disgusting, not news, you're disgusting, it's not right. I got you, so anyway, you see who your friends are, I know who my friends are, you, you know your friends, and I got all you here that love me, and care about me, you know how weak-minded and feckless I am, Carolyn didn't know I put a blue wrap on my smart car, so I unfriended her on the Facebook I don't have. She continues to be friends with Blind Views, the guy who keeps making negative videos about me because I got triggered about a little comment he hearted. King Camper Van Kevin ran and told me about it as fast as his limbs could run, just like a little schoolgirl would. And I'm gonna blow him real quick. Maybe he'll return the favor later with a pro. That ain't right. Did I really go there? I went. Well, Billy Bob was out there fishing and hunting. And Ted and Barbie were out playing tennis. I was studying the stuff. Get all the information I could. Go, 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 go. 20 years.
Yeah. Here we are. 